Hello friends, Misha Crossing here with a new day here in Kodama and Animal Crossing New Leaf. Wanted to play today a little bit more in the evening time, so it's like 4.30 or so right now. Um, I don't really have any plans for today. What do I have in my pockets? What did I do yesterday? Nothing. Oh, I went to, um... Um, 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 club LOL, and I learned a new emotion. I learned joy, which is a really super cute one, so I'm very happy about that. Um, yeah. Hybrid's going down there, which I'll tend to after the episode is over. Oh, dig this guy up. I'll probably. I might do like a quick episode today. I'll look at my little trees are growing. Might do a kind of quick episode today and then film a guide. Yeah, pitfall. I'm just gonna go bury this behind the town hall so I don't have to deal with it anymore. Um, <gasps> there's somebody camping! Oh, you guys. Who was my first camper? <laughs> Okay, so I might do a quick episode and then do a diving trick guide. That's what I've been trying to say. <laughs> oh. Let's see who we have. Oh, this guy. Oh, is he too close? Aw, uh, poop. That's a bummer. I guess it expands one space. It needs an extra space of... An extra space of space. Shoot. Oh well. I'll get another one. There will be more cedar trees. <gasps> Aww. Hi, Ruby. I bet you weren't expecting to see super stylish me here. Actually, I wasn't expecting to be here either. But I'm so glad I came. I took a bite of a famous Kodama apple and it was amazing. Oh, I want her to move in. I like her. She would actually fit the vibe of Kodama pretty well. I'm so glad I decided- I'm so excited that I got a good villager as my- er, yeah, a good villager as my first, uh, Camper, I'm so glad I decided to camp out here in the wild. I thought I'd just get dirty and stuff, but all this fresh air is doing wonders for my complexion. It's like a free beauty treatment. Oh, don't you just love this outdoorsy lifestyle? It's so very fashionable right now. Plus, I'm getting to meet a ton of cool new folks. Who knew getting back to nature would be so wild? Okay, I need you to ask to move here. Yeah, here we go. Sometimes I wonder what it'd be like to actually live in this town instead of just visiting. It's great! Move here! Yes, you living here in Kodama. Well, it's not a decision I can make lightly, that's for sure. Hmm. Oh, I know. We can play a game to decide. If you win, I'll move here. But if you lose, you have to donate that fishing rod to the Ruby, Ruby Souvenir Collection. Oh god. Okay, let's do it. I like your enthusiasm. Okay, let's play charades. Oh, okay. Hmm. You have to guess what I'm talking about. Watch the gestures I make and see if you can figure it out. Everyone will clap for you, and it makes you blush. When does that happen? Everyone will applaud you, and it makes you embarrassed or blush. When does that happen? Um, yes, on my birthday, because everybody is, uh, you know, singing to you and stuff. Yep. I don't like people singing to me on my birthday. My amazing performance totally clued you into the right answer, huh? Yay, I can't wait to pack my bags and move into town. Whoa, this is all happening so quickly. You're Misha, right? What a coincidence. My name's Ruby. Fate totally brought us together. Oh, I'm so excited, little baby. Just moving here, yay. <sighs> I'm so happy right now. This is great. Um, and then Eugene will be moving out, um, in two days. He'll be moving out on Saturday. Um, yeah, so that'll open up another spot, maybe if, uh, maybe I have a friend with a villager moving out, or if another good camper comes to town. Um, oh, also, oh, let's see what's on premium. Oh, pearl oyster and grasshopper. Um, also yesterday, I made a new design and just a simple quick little design and put it in um, the Able Sisters so that the villagers would stop wearing these god-awful um, generic, you know, <laughs> design shirts. They're so bad, huh? She's not sleeping. Oh well. 
Okay, I'll do my little main street tour now. Um, this is a fake rock. No. <laughs> there we go. Oh, pretty. A ruby. Love the rubies. I wonder if this is the money rock. Don't find out. Yep. Yes. Yay, I got it all! I was so, so focused. <laughs> I really wanted to make sure I got it all. <laughs> Yay. Well, I'm gonna have a little a little overflow. I'll probably buy some stuff on Main Street though. Nope, can't put any more. Alrighty, cool. Little bit of an overflow there. Um anything on the bulletin board? Nope. Nothing new there. Just got some ants on that rotten apple. Okay. Um, yeah, let's just start. Oh, I have an actual apple with me, don't I? Yes, I do. We'll go see Shrunk. Get an emotion. Get a uh, get an expression from him. My buddy. I know you're not open. I just brought a snack. Got you an apple here. Oh, I need to bury that uh, pitfall behind the town hall. I forgot about that. An apple? Don't mind if I do. Oh, that was quite satisfying. Well, thanks a bunch. I should probably return the favor now, shouldn't I? Yes, tell me a good joke. Get on up there. That'll be a good one. That's all I gotta say. Thank you, thank you. Dr. Shrunk is in the house. My old teacher's bashfulness joke is sure to cure what ails you. I think that's what it said. But I'm worried I won't be able to pull it off as well as he did. In fact, it might not make any sense at all, come to think of it. Guess I'll just have to try anyway. Prepare to see emotion in motion. You shall now see embarrassment appear in the very air. I was talking to my youngest daughter the other day, and then... She said that she thought I was 110 years old. And then... I got very embarrassed. I mean, 110? Do I really look that young to you? Oh wow, I'm embarrassed to even use that joke. <laughs> that young? So is that saying that Shrunk is... Oh yeah, aren't those... Whatever he is, like, really, really old, like, they live for a long time, or like, these ancient creatures? I don't know. I can't remember what type of fishy... amphibious creature. He is. Oh, no, I don't need to go in my pockets. I just need to go to my emotions. Oh, look at me. I'm bashful. I don't think I've ever gotten bashfulness in um, any of my games. And, like, I've visited Shrunk a bunch, and I don't think I've gotten that one. It's weird. Okay, on over to Nook's Holmes. What you got for me? Um, oh, I do like the multicolored pebbles. Colorful gravel, yes, please. Gimme. Because the rest of my house isn't really gonna have any colors, so the, the gravel can have some color. That'd be nice. Go on down and see what the Nook store has to offer me today. Hi, Digby! <laughs> like he can hear me yelling at him. I really want to get the new um What am I trying to say? <laughs> the new Nookling store soon. Yes, the ranch armchair. I'll get it. I like the ranch um series quite a lot, especially when it's when it's customized. I don't want either of those things though. Wood paneling, um, um, yeah, I'll take it. I might want it in one of my homes. What's this? Lovely carpet? No, I definitely don't want it. Don't even show it to me. <laughs> don't need to see it. Let's go next door to the Able Sister. Oh, no, wait, I gotta see Leaf first. Gotta get all my stuff from Leaf. It's... I was about to ask an opinion, but I know I won't be seeing the opinions for a very long time. 
after I film this, so I'm gonna forget completely about it, so never mind. <laughs> Alright, let me get some flowers. Yes, please. Red Cosmos. Mm-hmm. Yes. Good, I'm glad there's a cedar sapling. I will plant it um, pretty much immediately near the campsite, and I don't need to buy the watering can. Oh, I'm gonna have Ruby moving in. He dies. Oh, you guys. So happy. Okay, yeah, so there's the little shirt that I made. It's just like a floral kind of, sort of, design. Nothing fancy at all. I guess I can show it to you. <laughs> just really simple. Nothing. Nothing great. Just something to get them out of the, um, the silly generic shirts. But I, I don't mind the button-down one too much. I think it looks alright. Um, what are these? They're just... Oh, they're military pants? I mean, they're green. Um, yeah, I'll buy them. If one of my characters might benefit from it. We'll see. Because they're all green and, and earthy looking. Oh, I think I should get the bun. The big grandma bun. <laughs> Matronly bun, yes. I'll take it. Thank you. Also try it on. <laughs> Aw, how cute. <laughs> Might have a little grandma witch or something in town. We'll see. Okay, now... I don't think I'm gonna go down to Blathers. I don't have enough. I will go into Kicks, but I really don't have enough to go to Blathers. I think I just have that one fossil. Um, and I've got a couple more things to do in town before we end this episode. Hello. Um, I already have the brown flats and I don't want anything else, so I'm good. Thank you. Okay, so what do I need to do in town? I need to bury that pitfall. I'll do that first. Oh, and then plant that cedar sapling. Yeah. And then after I'm done with this episode, I'll do I'll tend to my hybrid garden and dig up any more fossils and whatnot. Um, and then I'll do a little explanation of the diving trick, a little diving trick guide. No, there we go. <laughs> okay, so I'll bury the pitfall. Nope, not right there. Right there. Okay. Good deal. I'm gonna, like, just punch myself if I end up, um, <laughs> falling in that somehow. Okay, so I'll go do that cedar sapling. I love this time of day. The sky's so pretty. Have I caught this butterfly yet? Can't tell. I think I might have. A Raja Brook butterfly. Yeah, okay, yeah, I remember I caught him and I was like, I've never caught one of these guys before. <laughs> Said it just like that, too. Um, okay, so I guess I'll dig that guy up. Yeah, so it's gotta be two spaces, huh? Bummer. Um, I guess I'll do it. Mm, right here? But I feel like I could do one right here. Is that enough space away? Maybe not, man. Maybe not. I'm just gonna do one right here. Plant. There we go. I'm going to release this guy. Oh, hello. What you want? Oh, good. I've been looking for you, Misha. It's room inspection time. Let's head over to your place and see how clean it is. Haven't you already been over? Or maybe that was Grizzly. Okay, let's go. Awesome, I get to see Misha's place. Okay, I'll follow your lead. Yeah, I think that was old Grizzly Bear that came to my house. Maybe it was Al, I can't remember. Oh, look how funny he looks. Running behind me. Ooh, a lost item! Yay! I picked up a lost item! I wonder if someone dropped this. Maybe I should look for the owner and return it. 
I actually might keep this one so I can use it in my house sometime. Um, so here we are at my little humble, humble abode. I need to plant some cedar trees around my house too, because it's, you know, technically below the river, but it's in the northern part of the town. Honey, I'm home! <laughs> Just kidding. Yes, come in, look around. So what do I have going on in my pockets? I got two fossils, another apple for shrunk tomorrow. I can put some of this stuff up. I can plant those on the beach. I can sell a couple. Mm, yeah, I'll go ahead and sell those because I probably won't be using them anytime soon. Uh, yeah, cool. Okay, Al, what you think of my place? You've had a minute to look around. Wow, I'm really in Misha's house. I've been dreaming about this moment for so long. Oh God, what a little, what a little fan girl. Aren't you going to put anything up on the walls, Misha? Bare walls are kind of freaky. If it were me, I'd probably put up a poster or something. Maybe a poster of sauerkraut. Oh god, I hate sauerkraut. No. Oh, okay. This visit's over since he just talked about sauerkraut. We're done here. <laughs> yep, you should leave too. Get gone. <sighs> Okay, I'm gonna end that episode here and then go do a make a guide on the diving trick. Which if you don't know, that is how you um, get suggestions for public works projects a little bit more often. Oh wait, I don't have a thing. I don't have a wetsuit. Well, let's just take a little field trip to the island real quick and see if there's um, a wetsuit there. I'll probably just skip the ride with Captain and, uh, not Captain, Captain. <laughs> so cute. Um, yeah, I'll skip this trip and just cut to, uh, being there. Here we are on the island and, <sighs> no wetsuit. Bummer. Oh well, okay guys, I guess I won't be making a diving trick um, episode yet. I completely spaced on having to have um, a wetsuit. Oh well. Well, I'll end this episode here and go do my daily activities, uh, hybrid garden stuffs, and uh, I will talk to you all tomorrow. Um, thank you all so much for watching, be kind to one another, and don't forget to be awesome. Bye!